Hi, I'm going to show you a new plugin that allows you to create and edit, um, suspend uh, Twilio sub accounts, uh, add phone numbers, move phone numbers between sub, sub accounts. And um, if you're familiar with Twilio, it's twilio.com. And you can see uh, right here, twilio.com. And um, most of you are familiar with Twilio already. But um, you can go into, if you already have sub accounts, if you've created them through another application, you can view those sub accounts inside your main Twilio account. Uh, and you can view the phone numbers and that type of thing. But you really can't edit anything about that sub account uh, while, while you're in here. So, um, what, I, what I'm going to show you is a, an easy way to be able to manage, create and manage multiple sub accounts on multiple Twilio accounts. So, um, what you do is when you have your Twilio account, you're going to need this account SID and token. So, if I grab this real quick, uh, I'm now going into the plugin and it's called just simply Twilio accounts. And uh, here on the left hand nav, and you go to add new. And let's just call this um, whatever you like, main Twilio account. It could be a client account or something like that. But uh, this interface allows you to create and manage these sub accounts so that um, if you have multiple clients possibly using other um, systems, for example, uh, most of the things I've created allow you, you know, uh, my SMS plugin allows you to do a lot of what you see here, but you might be using another system. And maybe it doesn't allow you to easily manipulate these things. So, uh, if I uh, plug in my SID here, let me pause and grab. Let me go over here and grab. This is where I'll click to grab my token. Okay, so I copied that. Go back in here, drop in my token, and go ahead and hit the publish, and I'll save these settings. And now what I can do is start manipulating the sub accounts. And now. A lot of you might not have you might not have a sub account set up already. Uh, I already have some created, but if you're starting from scratch and you might not have any in here, what you do is you can just type in a name for that sub account, um, and let's say it's um, it could be anything, and go ahead and hit click on the new sub account button. And when you do that, it's going to reload. And then you can. Select. There's the ABC company I just created, and now what I can do is a couple things, several things. One is uh, I can change the name. So if I don't want to uh, change the name, and I can just update it, hit rename, and you'll see that it updates here and here above. And um, you can also delete it. And when you do that, if you have any uh, phone numbers in, uh, attached to that account, those will be released. So be careful with the delete function. It will prompt you to make sure that's what you want to do. And then another thing which is very nice is you can suspend and unsuspend an account. So if I suspend it, you'll see that it's now uh, is red to indicate that it's turned off or suspended, meaning that there's no in and out messages via SMS or phone calls or any of that sort of thing, but the, the account remains in place and it will keep any phone numbers associated with it. I can activate the account and everything should work as normal again. Now let's go into an account that has a phone number in it. So if I go to this one, we'll see the phone number show up here and you'll see the URLs that exist. So let's say uh, if I want to change the the name of of this, um, this is called the friendly name for this phone number. So this might be the breakfast line or whatever. But anyway, editing it, you just click on it and then hit close, and then those changes are saved. Uh, if you want to change the URL, you can do that here. And this is stuff that you can do from within Twilio, but it's convenient uh, convenient that you can do it here as well. And then uh, let's say. This line you want to move into another sub account because maybe that client doesn't exist or for whatever reason you just need to move those uh, phone numbers. Just click on the move button and you'll get a list of all your sub accounts. And so I could move it into the company I just created. Hit OK and we'll see this number disappear. Now if I go into my ABC company, you'll see the number there that I just created. I'm going to go ahead and move it back and put it back here into the caves. Okay. 
and there we go so uh, again uh, sub accounts are great uh, to use with some other plugins if you don't have my SMS WordPress plugin some of my other plugins uh, this might be handy a handy companion for um, but uh, you know some uh, the, the features basically that you gain through this are you can delete sub accounts something you can't do inside of Twilio you can of course create sub accounts um, uh, that you can't do inside the Twilio uh, dashboard uh, you can edit the name you can move the phone numbers and then you can suspend and uh, or reactivate uh, a sub account all from within this plugin uh, one additional thing is you can search and uh, buy phone numbers so if you want to look for something in a certain area code you can add that there and here you see the results that are available in this area code uh, even gives you the uh, zip code and the kind of the city or region as well and then uh, you can even search for things uh, in a specific zip code or without a, or a area code you can search um, maybe something that contains uh, certain digits so if you wanted something that contained uh, three zeros or something like that you can enter that and see what comes back in the area code or possibly across the country there we have the the three zeros are kind of scattered throughout but you gives you uh, some choices there and then you can even search for things like um, by uh, text or things that correspond to the keys on the the phone uh, keypad so if you look for text I want something with the word text in it here's something that has uh, 8398 is actually uh, text so uh, or let's say you want SMS I'm not sure what that corresponds to, but you can grab that as well. And uh, then when you're ready to buy a number, just click on Buy Now. It'll prompt you to make sure, and you can hit OK. When you do, that number will show up in your phone numbers here. So uh, it's a handy uh, plug-in to be able to create and manage your Twilio sub-accounts if you don't have a way to do that already. All right, thanks for checking it out.